Thank you. It's a real pleasure to be here, and I brought along some songs to sing for all you folks that I have on Hickory Records and that I do on the Grand Ole Opry in Nashville, Tennessee, and I hope that somewhere along the way I'll be able to do one that you'll like just a whole lot. What are you going to do first for us, Ernie? Well, if I can get these Kentucky Colonels to help me out, I'd like to do a song that I do have on Hickory Records. I hope that all you folks will like it. It's called Pushed in a Corner. <laughs> Thank you, and we hope that you'll keep that up because it makes us feel real good. We'd like to do a song now that is in our current Hickory album. This is one of my favorite songs. I hope that it's one of your favorites. It's called Love Has Come My Way.
Well, thank you once again, and I'd like to call on the Kentucky Colonels once more to help me do a song that made it possible for me to become a regular member of the Grand Ole Opry, Talk Back, Trimming Lips. <laughs> thanks to you, my thanks to the Kentucky Colonels, and it's really been a pleasure. Weren't they great friends? And now we'll hear from one of our leading citizens, Cyrus B. Clark. Come on, you music-loving folks that like your music sad. I'll tell you about the trouble that a certain farmer had. He worked from dawn till after dark to keep the old homestead. But still the farmer, Farmer Brown, was always in the red. So Farmer Brown had trouble and Farmer Brown had woe. The crops he grew he couldn't sell, the others wouldn't grow. The others wouldn't grow. He wrote the U.S. government, it wouldn't do no harm. He said he'd have to have some help or else he'd lose the farm. In Washington, D.C., they said, we'll lend a helping hand because they knew the farmer was the backbone of the land. So now he has no worries and now he has no woe because now he's making money from the things he doesn't grow. The things he doesn't grow. 